Hi there, it's Tanya from Touch Treasures. Hello and welcome back. So I've got some more belly band <coughs> type pieces. Um, some of them are from um, ends of when I've done collage things. And I'm not sure how I've got the others. Because these are just plain... Um, just plain so <clears throat> I must have cut them off uh, something so we've got these um I've been in my little folder and just got a load of small pieces out and then I've been in my scraps and pulled some um you know <clears throat> longish finish things so just they're going to be just simple uh belly bands nothing you know nothing too too much so I'm going to start off with this widest piece because I do want to <coughs> use this and I'm thinking that'll probably I think that's the widest um, image that I've got so I'm going to use that and let's have a look I think that's spot on <laughs> absolutely spot on Maybe it's not. Nope. 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 Let's have a look at this. Oh, everything's knotted all together. It's the only thing when you shove everything in a <coughs> in a tin. It all tends to stick to each other. No, I think that's too much leaf. I'm just I'm gonna leave that um folded out over over there. So, no, I think probably the first one. So I'm going to put um hopefully a thin line of fabric down the middle. And just lay that on. It's that middle-ish. Just turn it down a little bit. I don't know if I'm going to have to st um, stitch these because I don't want to put too much glue on the, the glue seeping uh, through. We shall see. In fact, <coughs> I'm going to use <coughs> Kalau for um, the images. And just pop that. In the middle. I have inked all around these. Oh, that is the wrong way around. Yeah, that's funny. Ha ha ha. Because um, <laughs> when I put it that way, it really did look upside down. But no, that's <coughs> that's the right the right way. So that's and that's that. Well, <coughs> Yeah, I think I'm going to end up having to um, stitch them. So, I'll put that one to one side. What have we got next? Let's do a thin one. So, that's probably our thinnest. <coughs> um piece of lace that's probably one of our smallest cards so <coughs> that looks fine so again I'll just try and obviously need more than I had last time but Hi. 
okay. Miss Scrapton, because you never know when you might need a, a tiny bit of stuff. I've put far too much glue on that, but it all like seeps out. I'm gonna press really lightly. Just gonna get my <coughs> little pegs out. Yep. Okay, I'll just put that onto one side. Right, got another thin one. And I've got this in brown. Okay. If you only have like tea dyed um, strips hanging about, obviously you could do it on plain tea dye ones, but um. Or you could just get your scraps, your small scraps out and, and just do some collage um, bands and then decorate them up. I scream, man. That's that again, not quite a quite a thin one that's too thick. Well I like that one. <clears throat> Even though it's only got that little piece of lace, it, it's surprising how then your piece, what you stick on top, doesn't isn't laying flat. So um, the pegs are very, <coughs> very handy uh, for that if you don't want to, you know, sit around holding, holding and, and rubbing it. Right, so I think we want something a bit thicker. Some seam binding. So, because it's too small, I'm going to straighten the the ends. And Very big piece here, so yeah, I might put that over there. It's got all threads in it. <clears throat> better than just that seam binding <coughs> on its own I think we might need a little bit of oh that's nice a little bit of colour just 
better and brighten, brighten it up. up before I clip it down and then it will be forever wonky I've got these clips on my uh, Amazon favorite list if you're uh, wondering right so again we've got quite a thick one well that's nice Let's have a look at I'm wondering if oh I like that. It's <clears throat> a nice sage sage colour. These are all little bits left, well not left over, just little bits from um, all, all sorts of um, kits. I would say when I started doing the botanicals series I, I literally printed everything off um, botanical that I owned and you know printed it several times and in several sizes and, and things so yeah I've got lots to to use so that's that one right got one of those nope that is a bit of maybe I'm gonna put well I say maybe I'm putting it on, uh, but then I think I'm gonna put something else over the over the top. straighten this bit up when you rip it it tends to to curl take that all the way uh, to the top sorry if you can hear that banging I think next door's doing something um, in the garden I was putting the brown on, wasn't I?
like that one. I like that better. wanted to use this but I'm not sure about the, the colouring. Nope. Too small. I do like that. Go for that. I'll put the other one in my <coughs> thing because I don't think it overly goes with these tones. Oop. Trying the glue at myself. So I should have plenty of belly bands now. I think we've had a couple of sessions at making belly bands. Still got lots of strips, but um, <coughs> yeah, I'll have to do something else with them. So I don't think I need need any more belly bands, but never say never. <laughs> Might actually, um, if I do another belly band one, I'll do them uh, for width ways instead of length ways. But I like them um, length ways because obviously they're just good for side uh, tucks as well. I tend to use them more as side tucks than actual belly bands. Right, what have we got left? Got this bit of brown leaf. I like that. <clears throat> Probably get used in autumn, but yeah, I do like that. Oh, gloopy girl. Gloopy glue. I was going to say goopy goo. <laughs> and that. It's goopy goo too. Right. cotton stuck to me and all sorts <clears throat> try and just get some of that <coughs> excess, excess glue off yeah. Right, oh, we're going for this one, aren't we? Shall we go for this one? Go for, go for. Oh, I like that. Yeah, I'm going to go for that one. Go for, my dear. Honestly, if my mum could hear me sometimes, <laughs> she'd say, oof. Oh, I've got these images there. I'd forgotten about them. Out of sight, out of mind. Sometimes that works out for the best, <laughs> depending depending who it is. <laughs> right, that's that one. I'm going to have a whole lot of pegs to, to take off. 
Right, so we've got this left. That's quite nice. <coughs> we've got that bit of string what I don't want. So we've got that. We've got that. I'm quite liking that. It's going to be a nightmare to glue, though. I've got that. I don't think we're going to use that or that. I'm going to go for this one. <coughs> Oh, how long did it go? Did it go the whole way? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. It's like a spider. It's been a eyelash trim. I bet you I could leave those on the floor, you know. And uh, I mean, Eleanor doesn't like spiders, but she's not like a... Well, she is a little bit afraid, actually, but... Uh, my middle daughter, oh my goodness me, I wouldn't try and uh, trick her, trick her. Um, yeah, she's absolutely petrified. Yeah, I've seen her, like, not be able to move and, and things. She's really very scared. <coughs> uh, whereas Eleanor just dislikes them. But, yeah, if you put that on the floor somewhere... Um, yeah, be uh, like I say, a mean, a mean uh, trick for somebody who's really doesn't like them. That's quite nice. I think I prefer that one. It's just got a little bit more, more to it. Right, well, that's used. It's used my strips up. It's used some of the uh, <coughs> longer pieces of, of things because that was about the longest, you know, scraps I'd, I'd got. And it's used some small images, wasn't it? I'm just going to pause for one minute just to give them all, uh, well, especially the last few ones, a um, chance to dry. Um, and why I'm doing that, I'm just going to tidy my table. Okay, I think they'll have all dried enough. That ribbon's stuck down fine, so I don't think I'm going to uh, sew them. So if I did, I'd be going straight through the through the middle of them. These would be nice to put on the front of um, envelopes as well <coughs> as a, a belly band on an envelope. Because if they end up being too big for whatever. Um, I'm using them for obviously I can I can chop them to to size I think sometimes I mean I've just used these papers because I've got them but um, if I was probably cutting strips up just to mass make some I'd probably do them over at all um, and then you'd have them to be able to cut cut down so that is those so thank you very much for tuning in today i'll say another quick one and we've used used a bit more stuff um so yeah i shall see you in the next video bye for now